Welcome, everyone. Brad Nessler here for EA Sports with my co-host, Kirk Herbstreet, and the coach, Lee Corso. The forecast calls for below freezing temperatures for tonight's battle between the Ohio State Buckeyes and the Cardinals of Louisville. Well, folks, we're excited to bring you what appears to be another great gridiron matchup. And here come the Cardinals. Fans on both sides think their team is going to win this thing. What's your prediction, Kirk? Louisville has the edge in this one, and literally, their defensive end has unbelievable speed and quickness off the edge, and that's the main reason I'm picking them to win this one. No doubt about it, Kirk. Watch out for the Cardinals. Kirk, Lee, we're just about set to see if you're right. Let's send it down to the field. Louisville is lined up to kick the ball off first, and we are ready to go. He sends it off. Number nine, passes it at the five. At the 30. Now let's see what kind of success. This kid, he's just too good. The halfback for the carry. Tackle made at the 44. Back to pass. Let's it fly. Picked off. He duped. Number 24 is the deep back as they line up in the eye. Hand off to the right. To the 20. To the 10. Touchdown, Cardinal. That was a big run by the halfback. Boy, this kid makes the defense look silly. They're grabbing at a bunch of air down there. They line up to kick this one away. Short kick. He didn't get a hold of that one. Number nine deals it at the 11. He'll get it again. He's hit and got away. Number Louisville lines up with five defensive backs. He's taken down at the 34 yard. Here's the give. And he tackles him hard. Comes to the line with three wide. He's looking. Moves up in the pocket. He unloads it. It's complete. And he's all over. Things up. Drops back to pass. He looks. Rolls to the right. Down the middle. And he's got it. Going the other way now. What a play. He just leaped up and picked it off. He showed some great patience there. He timed that perfectly. He's backfield. Setting up play action. He passes it. Caught. And he's taken down at the foot. Tries to juke. Tackle at the 36. They give to the tailback. Brought down at the 34. And that'll be enough. Again with a carry. And they make the stop at the 26. Running back pick. We're through one quarter. And the score is Louisville, seven. Ohio State, nothing. A little juke. The five, and he's got the touchdown. He kicks it off. Number 25, passes it at the five, breaks one. Back to pass. Looking over the middle, and it's the senior. And they'll run the option, and he takes a big hit. Option, and now he pitches it. Juke move. He's taken down at the 47. High formation. Again, he'll get the call. He didn't get it. It's wide. He'll give it off here. He breaks it. And down he goes at the 39. The Buckeyes line up with three wide. Tries to juke. Good open field tackle. About seven yards. Formation. Gets past the tackler. Fumbles the ball. It's picked up by the offense. And they make They'll bring him down at the 31-yard line. And they lose possession on down. You know, that was one of those situations where you have to go for it to try to get something. Because they line up in the eye. They'll give it off here. He sheds it. He's tackled at number 12. Lines up in the shotgun. The option left. Tackle made at the 44-yard line. Up second down. Number 12. Back in the gun. Looks. He's rolling left. Across the middle. Got it to his receiver. They'll bring it. Those kind of plays out there. He looks. They bring him down. Ohio State has all their DBs in for this five-wide set. And he's got it! They got to the quarterback a little late there. First of the Walking the passer. Let's see if they can get it in for the touchdown. Now he pitches it. 
Fumble, loose ball. Number one. Picks up the fumble. Coach, what went wrong there? And we'll go into halftime here with a score all deadlocked. Just about set to get underway as the teams line up for the kick. Kicks off. Number 25 takes it to 15. Down and a couple miles here. Ball on the 15-yard line. They'll work from the shotgun. He drops back. Looking. And he can't get away from the pressure. So they sent the blitz package on that one. Yeah, to the line with three wide. Tackle made at the 31. They line up in the shotgun. He's taken down at the lining up with three receivers. Back to pass. Sheds one tackler. He rifles it to the right. Touchdown, Buckeyes. How about the tight end? Short kick. He didn't get a hold of that one. Number 21 takes it to 12. They come out with three wide receivers. Here's the option. Lateral's back. Ball is loose. Fumble. Scooped up by the defense. And Mason hands it off. Tackle made at the point. Ohio State comes to the line with three wide. And it falls incomplete. The guards line up in a nickelback. Across the middle. Great concentration. Good job of it. Ohio State comes out in the shotgun. They go with the option. Number 17 loses the handle. Number 30 recovers a loose ball. He's looking to pass. Looks. He sails it long. And he makes the catch. To the 20. To the 10. And he will score. And the halfback just exploded for the huge play. He's into the back. He jukes. He spins around. He's all the way down to the 48-yard line. Picks up the loose ball. He got his hand in there and stripped that ball. The ball guards come out showing three wide. He lateral. They'll bring him down for a loss on the play. Louisville comes to the line with three wide. He's looking. He throws it. His receiver has it. He's tackled. And so we've reached the end of quarter number three here with one quarter to go. We're all tied up. The cards are lining up with three receivers. Here's an option, right side. And he stopped by. The halfback with a carry. Tries to juke. Tackle made at the fourth. Third and short, and they hand it off. They'll bring him down at the fourth. Here. He looks to throw on first down. He lets it go. Incomplete. He's going right. Caught. What a catch. Touchdown, Bucks. Terrific pass, and the wideout hauls it in for the touchdown. Brad, the wide receiver's route was the key on that throw. You're right, Kirk. This route running really has improved, and the quarterback has been throwing his way a lot more. And yeah, this is the He kicks it off. Number 25 from his own end zone. Three wide. First down, look at the throw. He looks. Number 12, rifles it over the middle. And he's taken down at the 28-yard line. Boy, does this kid have an arm or what? Are you kidding me? It looks like he has a rocket launcher attached to his shoulder. He drops it back. Here comes the pressure. There's a fumble. Number three, falls on the fumble. Not a good time to fumble the football. And that guy feels horrible about it. He's got to forget. Number 28, the lone back, hands it off. Brought down at the nine-yard line. Tackled for a loss. They give to the tailback. He's tackled at the nine. It's up. And it is good. Let me tell you, Kirk, why that field goal was so important. With the, and we're talking about a completely different situation. Fires deep down the left side. And they cover 12. Lines up with four wideouts. Looking. Deep pass down the right side. And got him. He's all the way down to the 31-yard line. Heck of a catch by the wideout to pick up a nice chunk of yardage. This kid is a very special football player. He can make the catch over the middle of traffic, or he can take it the distance using his speed. He can do it all. And that one. Defense looking for his first incompletion this drive. He lets it go. This one is incomplete. They'll line it up with four wide receivers. Looks. He goes downtown. That close to being intercepted. It's up. Looks long enough. 
And it's good. Not a bad kick to get your team three points, Kirk. Yeah, he got some good leg behind it, and he kicked an accurate ball right between the goalposts. Here's the Pontiac game-changing performance from today's game. Here. Here goes nothing. He tries to spin. Just about right. And that's pretty much going to do it. Kirk, what would you think of this one? I'm sad to see this one in because it was a great game to watch. Louisville played a good game out there, but they needed to make one or two more big plays, and they couldn't do it. Who knows? Another couple of minutes, and this one may have gone the other way. Folks, thanks for tuning in to our game. Our final score, Ohio State 24, Louisville 17. For Lee Corso and Kirk Herbstreet, I'm Brad Nessler with our final goodbye. We'll catch you next time.